Chris, what did you like most about your start tonight? Um, just competed. I mechanically was off a little bit, but uh, overall, just compete. How much of a difference is there in the game plan or not when you face the same team twice consecutively? Um, I, I would say I, I try to kind of do the same thing that's it's, it's working, but I know they're looking for what I kind of did last start, so it's kind of a cat and mouse game with that. So um, maybe a little bit less sinkers in to righties, knowing they, they got a lot of it last start, so do a lot more sliders tonight. What were some of the adjustments you had to make with you mentioned mechanics? Uh, I went away from my windup for the most part. Windup wasn't that great. Stretch was a lot better. Um, and I think I hit all my guys out of the windup. Just wasn't in sync with that tonight. So, um, yeah, it was just like I said, just mechanically, just getting right in the in the stretch of the windup. Was there a, a, an adjustment to either your approach or your mentality going into a game, knowing that tomorrow you have a double header and you guys want to save the bullpen a little bit more? No, I mean, I, I try to eat as many innings as I can. So, I mean, that really hasn't changed. Whoever has the hit, but you've been so good with runners in scoring position this year. Is that a point of pride for you um, to, you know, lock down when you need it the most? Yeah, I just uh, not try to do too much in those situations. Um, I got Schwarber with. A curveball and then like a slider in before that, and I really didn't think he was looking for a fastball up. I know how good of a fastball hitter he is, especially up. Um, took a shot there and obviously made me pay for it. First time throwing to Perez, um, easy transition. Yeah, um, me and him had a lot of talks of what I like to do, um, and he seems to be a really smart guy in the aspect of he picked it up really fast, and we had some some changes in game but overall he was he was really good what has it been like to watch Pete every day I mean he's an all-star um 30 homers over 100 RBIs right now so yeah he's a huge part of our lineup big pride kind of being a I guess a stopper if you will just kind of getting back on track you know having uh, the Braves taking three out of four from you guys yeah, I mean, I, I understand the the aspect of losing the series to the Braves was, was not great, but I mean, just treat every day as one day. Um, I, I think in the past, being with Oakland, kind of trying to always chase Houston, um, I, I think we made a really big mistake of constantly worrying about Houston. Um, and I don't think Houston ever really worried about us. So... Um, I, I think we we respect the Braves, we understand the Braves, but um, we can't really worry about what they're doing. So today was a new day, win today, and that's it. So um, that's that's pretty much it. It's just win today. Pete Tempers have a hard time, but whenever they got, they didn't get to get much, but whenever they got hits, they were doing a lot of damage. Just go up and able to kind of keep them off bay for most of the game. Yeah, I feel like I've done that pretty much really well all year. It's just. I know I have a lot of pitches, so it's just whatever I think they're looking for to do the opposite.